Tuesday, February 5, 2019, 12 a.m., 55 degrees Fahrenheit, 3 a.m., 49 degrees Fahrenheit, five-day forecast revealed. Bombshell claims that James Brown and his third wife Adrienne were murdered, as 13 people close to the Godfather of Soul demand criminal probe, including the doctor who signed death certificate surviving son of family killed by BTK. Serial killer Dennis Rader recalls the chilling moment he came home from school to discover his parents and two young siblings bound in strangled at their home Trump nominee for Brett Kavanaugh's old judicial seat tells senators she cringes at college age writing that women make choice to get too drunk to consent to sex Liam Neeson film premiere appearance cancelled after insisting he's not racist for primal urge to murder a black bee asterisk 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 d when his friend was raped by black man Trump did not consult me on Syria troop fallout says top general commanding U.S. Forces against ISIS as he warns terror group is an enduring threat. Modern family ending after upcoming 11th season on ABC Oklahoma courthouse is forced to close for the day after bedbugs are spotted crawling all over a lawyer's clothes and case files. Never gets old, a million fans pack the streets of Boston to celebrate Tom Brady and the Patriots at the Super Bowl victory parade as Rob Gronkowski goes shirtless and pounds beers with teammates. I'm so far from perfect, Tom Brady admits he does not help wife Giselle around the house, he's introverted, and he cringes when people call him the greatest of all time. Tom Brady deserves to be ranked above Woods, Ali, Federer and Williams as the greatest of all time. He's defied the aging process to win six Super Bowls and given up $60 million to keep the Patriots at the top Boston Brawlers. Patriots fans bring a street to a standstill with mass fight during the Super Bowl victory parade. Patriots Super Bowl after party, shirtless Rob Gronkowski downs a bottle of vodka. Julian Edelman dances with Snoop and Tom Brady cradles the Lombardi trophy while rocking $20,000 worth of Tom Ford. Better him than me, Arizona man, 60, shot dead guest, 31, at his Super Bowl party after inviting group of friends over to watch the game. Popular Twitch streamer and game studio employee is among 21 men arrested in Super Bowl child sexting after he tried to seduce an undercover agent he thought was a 14-year-old girl on the app Whisper. I can't unsee it. Twitter users are left convinced that one of Adam Levine's tattoos spells the word bro by using his nipple as the O. Oh, so, can you guess what the ink really means? The Brady Bunch. Tom is joined by pigtailed daughter Vivian and son Benjamin as Patriots celebrate Super Bowl triumph with open top bus parade through Boston. I got a boo. Cory Booker reveals that he's dating somebody that's really special after being linked to actress Rosario Dawson as he launches White House bid which would make him first bachelor president since 1884. Trump hits 48% approval in his favorite poll as he prepares for State of the Union, hitting his highest rating since government shutdown began. He's just upset that he didn't win the Senate, says Trump after Schumer gives his administration at failing grade and says America's union needs drastic repair. A handful of House Democrats will boycott Trump's State of the Union, but gaggle of presidential contenders and Ocasio-Cortez will be there. President Trump mispronounced Bhutan and Nepal as button and nipple before mistakenly saying they both belong to India. Foreign correspondent tells Stun TV host revealed, the 10 U.S. Cities where rents are rising faster than anywhere else in the nation Autopsy shows Vine and HQ trivia founder died of an accidental overdose of fentanyl, heroin, and cocaine I can't do this anymore Sunny D's Twitter account sparks confusion and concern with very melancholic post As brands like Pop-Tarts and Moon Pie respond with messages of support A group of New England Patriots fans engaged in a wild melee as Boston celebrated the franchise's sixth Super Bowl title on Tuesday Around a dozen or so fans were seen fighting in a video posted to Twitter a small percentage of the punches thrown actually hit their intended targets, but those that did appeared to cause some damage at 1.2 combatants became untangled and spilled out onto the street, where one face planted into the pavement by Alex Raskin Sports News Editor for DailyMail.com published, 1650 Eastern Standard Time, the 5th of February 2019, updated, 1717 Eastern Standard Time, the 5th of February 2019 Not content to simply watch their favorite football team parade through town, a group of New England Patriots fans engaged in a wild fist fight as Boston celebrated the franchise's sixth Super Bowl title on Tuesday, around our dozen or so fans were recorded by Twitter user Colin Beat engaged Engaging in the all-out melee, a small percentage of the punches thrown actually hit their intended targets, but those that did appeared to be effective. A group of New England Patriots fans engaged in a wild fist fight as Boston celebrated the franchise's sixth Super Bowl title on Tuesday.
around or dozen or so fans were recorded by Twitter user Colin Beat engaging in the all-out melee at one point two combatants became untangled and spilled out onto the street, where one face planted into the pavement. His aggressor then got up to look for another opponent, while he remained face down in the street bottom. At one point two combatants became untangled and spilled out onto the street, where one face planted into the pavement. His aggressor then got up to look for another opponent while he remained face down in the street. Eventually someone who appeared to be a friend went to see if he was okay. The Patriots were celebrating their Super Bowl 53 win over the Los Angeles Rams on Tuesday. Possibly hundreds of onlookers recorded the fight on their cell phones while a few good Samaritans attempted to break up the skirmish or tend to the wounded. At the end of the fight, a 12-pack of Pabst Blue Ribbon can be seen in the corner of the frame, perhaps lending some context to the situation. At the end of the fight, a 12-pack of Pabst Blue Ribbon can be seen in the corner of the frame, perhaps lending some context to the situation advertisement female today don't miss.